Hi, I'm Jasmine. My husband Gozie and I are expats who have lived in Morocco, India, and now Ecuador with our busy toddler. I can't wait to inspire you to travel more, try new cuisines, and become empowered through your motherhood journey. Today, spend the day with us as we grocery shop, get some of our favorite things, and navigate life solo parenting here living in Ecuador. Good morning and welcome to a day in my life. I have had a very busy morning so far, and so has Gideon. We are trying to foster some independence in this baby. And that includes picking out his clothes. Close this door, please. Doing his own chores. Don't look in there. It's a hot mess. Close the door, please. And yeah. So we're about to go to the store, get some groceries. I've been solo parenting for about three or four days now. And I need to get groceries in this house so that we can actually sustain ourselves. My husband is also coming back today too. So you know, we're just getting it all together. You did a good job picking this one out. Okay, you ready? Look at mommy. Okay, there we go. Okay, I need you to go get your shoes on. Yeah. My shoes on, I mean just get your shoes yeah. in your hand. Yeah. Go get your shoes on. And mommy will follow right after. I'm coming, okay. Okay, and get things to go. Let's go. Okay, let's hit the road. We are here and I'm really happy to replenish and get some things because yeah, we have zero groceries and zero fresh items. So let's go in, let's get this baby out of his chair and uh, yeah, let's go shopping. Yeah, we just got some blueberries. We always get a medium-ish pack because we always go through them. Strawberries here are just okay. Well, most of the time they're a little rotten. These look pretty good though, I think we'll get these are kind of hidden too. I'd prefer to get these. 99 cents a lot, girl. Don't tempt me with a good price. Today is a little bit of a quicker shop. I'm just going to get stuff in a package. Just because I really want to spend the time to prep like I usually do. Um, just get some spinach. All right, and then we need some tortillas. Oranges actually look super good today. I was saying the produce at this store isn't my favorite. Oh, lo siento. These are super good. I'm really impressed. Are you impressed? Yeah. Better. So let's go get those. Look at theirs. I touched something wet. Ooh. Mommy needs to disinfect. Okay, you want your snack now? Yes. Hi. 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 Here you go, baby. There you go. Are you excited for your snack? Okay. Yes, <laughs> Watermelon are back. I think we should get half of watermelon. Maybe. I don't know. It's kind of expensive. And it's a lot. I end up eating a watermelon all by myself, so maybe we'll pass on this one. I love when they have sweet potatoes. And when they look like this, they're big and juicy. I think mango season was fast this year. I only got mangoes like twice, which isn't a lot. It's not a lot at all. We do need limes. Some big limes. Yeah. I said no onions. Zucchini. We need zucchini. Ginger. Spinach. Cucumber. All right. So this is all that we have. It's not that full of a basket, but we did get the essentials, which I'm happy about. I just need to get one more thing and then we're going to head home. Alright. I love that I was finally able to replenish. I did it all in one trip too. You are a part of the one trip 
grocery gang like you only need one trip to get your groceries from your car or your uber to the house <laughs> then you are my people because i'm not mm -mm, i'm not for having to do things multiple times <laughs> anyway uh let me get this baby down for his nap it is 11 o'clock so it is nap time and then i will unload all the groceries and then show you some of my favorites all right we are down and i have to say being a mom is so hard but it is so cool so amazing i am just so impressed <laughs> with my baby as probably are all moms <laughs> with their children as well all parents um and yeah i'm just <laughs> i really miss him and i just put him down for his nap and he's not even asleep yet he's just hanging out until he falls asleep but that is not the moral of this story i am supposed to show you what i got from the grocery store so let me do that before I run out of energy, it's been a long morning. So we've got some chicken. Uh, this chicken looks like it's already cut, which is kind of nice. This week I'm looking for shortcuts. Uh, I don't really want to do a lot of meal prepping, meal making, because I did a lot of that last week. And then some cilantro. I'm going to make some cilantro lime dressing, some spinach, uh, a zucchini, and a cucumber. And then in that same bag, is it all in the same bag? Maybe this is a different bag. All of this cleaning and hygiene stuff. Um, so I'm going to probably twist my hair up sometime soon. And I got a claw clip. I want to be one of those claw clip girlies. So I figured, why not try it? It was like $2. And, and then I got some body wash as well. Got eggs in this bag. Gideon's little snacks. He loves these. And we've got some Pocari chocolate. This is the maracuya flavor or passion fruit flavor. And I love this one. It's got like little crunchy bits in it, which is fantastic. Gotta show you my bag. <laughs> this bag, uh, a lot of the bags we have or had before they all broke from the US. Um, this one is a TJ Maxx bag and it was gifted to me. And I love this women power, lady power. And um, ladies and women of color, so I love that. This bag is all full of fruit, and uh, I'm not gonna take everything out right now. I'll show it to you at the end, it's heavy. These are my favorite tortilla chips. I like to make like a little bean salad, or I guess what the girlies are calling it nowadays, cowboy caviar. Um, you can check out my Pinterest for some of the recipes that I like to use, but that's what those are gonna be for, so good. Just a small pack of water. Like I mentioned, my husband's coming home, so I wanted to kind of like think in advance for him and get some things. So he likes his bottled water. Um, I'm going to make this Thai curry noodle dish. So I've got some uh, vegetable broth. These crackers, this brand of crackers, so good. They have a quinoa chia flavor. Let me get it out of the cabinet. And uh, so good. I had to re-up. They didn't have this flavor. But they did have the cheese, and the cheese is also good. Coconut milk for that soup. Coconut sugar for baked goods, mostly like a banana bread. This is the curry that I'm going to be using for that soup as well. Just a small bag of Lay's. I'm feeling like a wrap today. I think that's my what we might have today is a chicken wrap. I think that's what we're gonna have. We got some hummus and I actually got two containers of this hummus because it is so good. Got my husband some yogurt that he likes. This is the yogurt that Gideon and I eat. This is just your regular plain Greek yogurt. So a Greek yogurt as well, but this is lemon flavor. More of like a lemon lime flavor. It is so good. Um, some feta cheese. I'm gonna make a cucumber and tomato salad and that's gonna go with this where did i put it ah the salmon so i'm gonna make this salmony dill i forgot dill i'm saying it and i forgot the dill so some salmon with like an herby sauce and then a cucumber and tomato salad 
with some feta and balsamic vinegar, olive oil, all that good stuff. That is it. Uh, let me show you all the produce. Let me get it out of the bag and then I'll give you the total for today's purchase. So we've got these cherries. I am obsessed with cherries and so is Gideon. I am so happy that it's cherry season. And um, we also got some oranges. I need to look to see how much these oranges were. It looked like they're expensive based off of the price tag per kilo, but um, I want to see how much they were for two. Strawberries, avocados, uh, tomatoes, peppers, bananas, sweet potatoes, blueberries, limes, and apples. And that's it. We spent $142.35 for all of this stuff. I don't know if I talked about these uh, Kotexes, but I'm trying these for the first time. I usually try to order what I need, but it does take some time and then I use them up and need to order more. So I figured I would try these. The issue that I've had with trying feminine products here in Ecuador, not even just abroad. I think I've had pretty good luck in the other countries I've lived in, but here in Ecuador, um, a lot of them are more panty liner size than like useful for what I need. And then the ones that are thicker, heavier, um, I feel like they're not clear, clean and clear. So these are puro y natural. Um, so suelen por y natural. So hecho sin co colorantes y sin. So without any colorants and fragrances. And I do find that my periods are 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 times better with cleaner menstrual products. Um, I used to have really bad cramps, really bad periods in general. Once I switched over to cleaner products, I, I improved significantly even though I still <laughs> get pain and all the things. This kind of a product is helpful. So I'm excited to try these to see what they are like. Now that I'm done cleaning up and putting the groceries away, I need to wash the fruits and vegetables. <laughs> that means I need to tackle these dishes um, and also get this giant plant out of my sink. Um, when my husband is in town and he's home, he usually handles the big plant for me. It is heavy. So let's see if I can do it on my own. Cause it's definitely heavier now that it's been watered and it has water in it. Oh my gosh, lifting with my knees. Oh, oh it's still dripping. That is what we're looking like right now. These plants also have homes as well. So let me get these set up too. Strawberries, cherries, blueberries. I'll get washed first. Um, I wish I had a stopper because I could just like wash everything in the sink, but the bowls are good. The bowls are fine. Just do the best with what you have. And then I'll just let them soak for maybe like 10 minutes. Then come back, rinse them, let them dry and then finish up everything else. It's really all right. Fun. I think I'm going to end the video here. I finished all the fruits and vegetables, put everything away. Baby had a nap. He's over here sitting on the counter while I make him lunch. We are doing our lunch thing right now. Um, I am currently just putting together wraps for us. This is what he's eating for lunch. And then this is mine. I still have to wrap mine up and everything. Uh, but yeah, that's it. This is what our fruit and vegetable stash is currently looking like. We clearly already dug in and ate and everything. Thank you so much for watching. I will talk to y'all in the next one. Definitely leave comments down below letting me know what you want to see on this channel. And until next time, bye.